Your HomePod mini is more than just a smart speaker. Setting it up with your iPhone can enable key features like intercom, handoff, and more. And today we're gonna walk you through how to set it up. All right, first things first. If you don't already have it, you will need to download the Home app on your iPhone and create a new account. Take the room you're gonna use for the HomePod mini and plug it in. You'll hear a chime and the top of the HomePod mini will have a white spinning light indicating it's ready for setup. Make sure your iPhone is connected to Wi-Fi and Bluetooth is turned on. Then hover your phone unlocked near the HomePod mini. A screen will pop up on your phone, then hit setup. This will bring up the steps to set up the HomePod mini on your phone. Follow the prompted instructions like what room the HomePod mini is in, and then it'll activate the camera on your phone to visually capture the smart speaker. You just need to place the HomePod mini in the center of the frame and then it'll begin the setup, which may take a few minutes. Lastly, it'll ask you to set up Siri by completing a few phrases. And don't forget this step, it's important later on to use the key features. And if you're finding this video helpful so far, don't forget to subscribe to How To Do It All and ring that bell so you won't miss another video. Now that your HomePod mini is set up with your iPhone, there's a couple of features you can enable to get the most out of your smart speaker. First, you can set up the handoff feature to be able to transfer music from your iPhone to your HomePod mini simply by hovering your phone near the smart speaker. To enable it, open the settings app on your iPhone. Go to General, then Airplay and Handoff. Make sure that Transfer to HomePod and Handoff are both turned on. Now you can transfer music from your iPhone to your HomePod mini by hovering your phone near the smart speaker for a few seconds. You can also transfer the music to play back on your phone by hovering it again near the HomePod mini. You can also use AirPlay to stream music from your iPhone to your HomePod mini. On your phone, open the control center, then tap the AirPlay icon and select your HomePod mini from the list. Next, if you have multiple HomePod minis, you can use them as an intercom system throughout your whole house. The intercom feature allows you to send voice messages through Siri to everyone in your home or just a specific room depending on your smart speaker's location. Apple even took it a step further and allows you to use the intercom feature not only with the HomePod, but also your iPhone, iPad, Apple Watch, AirPods, and even CarPlay. To set it up, make sure your HomePod mini software is up to date. The same goes for your iPhone, iPad, etc. Make sure the software is up to date on all of your devices. After updating, the intercom feature should be turned on automatically on the HomePod mini. To manage your settings, open the Home app on your phone. Tap the Home icon and then Home settings. Tap intercom and then you can adjust when to receive notifications, who has access to the intercom feature, and which home pods you want to interact with. You can ask Siri or use the Home app to send an intercom message. Ask Siri on your device like your iPhone or the HomePod mini, hey Siri, intercom it's time to wake up. Or hey Siri, ask everyone, is the dishwasher clean? Or open the Home app on your iPhone and tap the voice recording icon in the top right corner of the screen. Say your intercom message like, tell everyone that dinner is in five minutes, and then tap done. You can also reply to intercom messages after your HomePod mini receives them. Keep in mind though that if the original message was sent to the whole house, your reply will go back to every device with notifications turned on. And likewise, if the message was sent from a specific room, your reply will only go back to that device or that room. You can reply with phrases like, hey Siri, reply, I'll be right there, or hey Siri, reply five more minutes, and if you want to reply to a specific room, you can say, hey Siri, reply to living room, I'll be right there, or hey Siri, reply to kitchen, five more minutes. Now with these key features enabled on your HomePod mini, it's more than just a smart speaker, it's an integral part of your home. What do you guys use your HomePod mini for? Let us know in the comments below. And if you liked this video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to How To Do It All.